with meteorologist Chad Evans. Weather from where you live. Well, live Doppler 18 is clear right now, but there is a little patchy drizzle out there, but it's not showing up on radar. But there is rain off to the west. I'm going to show that to you here in just a bit. But for many areas of the Midwest, this has been the coldest October on record thus far. And for us, it's ranking in the top five coldest for the first 14 days of this month. For the daily high temperature, we are running nearly 12 degrees. Yeah, that's a big number, 12 degrees below normal. And at night, we've been running about 2.8 degrees below normal. And overall, if you take the average temperature, that is the high and the low, we're about 7 degrees below normal. No matter which way you slice it, these are pretty unprecedented numbers. And again, it's causing our peak and fall color to arrive a little sooner. So starting this weekend and lasting into early next week, we're going to start to see peak fall color for all you leaf peepers out there. But here comes the next wave of rain. We told you at 6, the rain would expand in Missouri. You can see what's happened. It's really exploded here over the past about four to five hours. You get the idea. This is headed our way. This is wave two of rain that we've been advertising. And this rain could be pretty steady later tonight and into tomorrow morning. Let's track it with Futurecast. Again, moving in tonight, there's the rain. Steady, a little heavier than it was this morning as well. But the good news is, just like today, most of the steadier rain will pull out of here after the noon hour. Then we'll just be left with some pesky cold drizzle, still strong northeast winds, and a lot of cloud cover for tomorrow. And then even for Friday, I think at least a few very widely scattered showers pivoting in from the northwest. So again, here is tomorrow's map. Highs only in the mid 40s, strong winds out of the northeast, steady rains in the morning, then patchy drizzle in the afternoon. And then even into Friday with our low wrapping up here off to our east, still at least a few scattered showers pivoting in from the northwest, but cold high temperatures, unusually cold weather, highs only in the mid 40s. And up here in Pennsylvania, up in New York, we're talking about Icing and yes, snow. There is a winter storm watch in effect. Believe it or not, winter storm watch in effect for parts of Pennsylvania, even northern Maryland into New York for later tomorrow and on into Friday. Rainfall for us, though, if we take what we got today and what we're going to get tonight and tomorrow morning, a half inch to one inch of rain. Thankfully, the heaviest rain staying to our south. And yes, harvest delays for all of our area farmers. Cold at the Purdue game on Saturday at 44 with a moderate to hard freeze over the weekend. Here's the good news, warming up very nicely. Finally, near normal temps, but rain and storms moving in by the early part of next week. Rain arrives tonight, breezy and raw, all the way down to 40 degrees. Tomorrow, 46, rain, but it will taper, taper off to just patchy drizzle in the afternoon. Breezy and gloomy and cold. Again, with temperatures way below normal. Cold on Friday at 45, 44 on Saturday, but staying dry. And then finally, a nice warm up. We'll be back to normal Tuesday and even a little bit above normal Wednesday with showers and storms.